Well, this is our new, uh, new Sterling hot end we're going to use. Turn it down quite thin. I'd say about 22 gauge. And I'm doing some heat test now. At 480 degrees on the burner there. And we're going to add some uh, torch power. Make sure that it wouldn't melt. It almost touched the top. There's some water inside of it, so that's what you're hearing right now. I'm going to check the distortion after I check this seat here. I don't know, hold it. I've seen guys holding torches for a long time on their uh, engines, so make sure that mine's not too thin walled. Inside, I've got a piece of balsa wood that I've done some heat tests on, and we're not going to. Uh, Use it unsheathed, we're going to put some Kevlar around our balsa displacer. Yeah, it looks like it's holding the heat quite well. And there's cherry red. That's quite cherry right there. It's also another stainless ashtray I picked up at the dollar store. It only cost about two bucks and it's about twenty gauge I'd say. Sixteenth of an inch thick. This one's more like a thirty second of an inch and we're gonna weld this to a steel flange, a stainless steel flange and insulate that from the other part of the engine.